Welcome to the setup video for the mobile x-ray truck. The first step is safety, making sure that both of the grounding straps are intact on either side of the truck. Next, open the door and secure the latch along the side of the truck. After the door is secure, release the retaining bolt from the ramp and place it into the holder as shown. Pull out the ramp, making sure to keep the ramp above the level of the truck bed or it won't pull out smoothly. When the ramp stops, lower it down to the ground. Make sure that the top of the ramp is seated flush against the truck. In this example, the left side of the ramp catches against the truck and needs to be repositioned. Now the ramp is positioned appropriately. Next, affix the guardrail to the side of the ramp. Make sure to start with the end closest to the ground. Secure the guardrail to the ramp, utilizing the grounding strap and the retaining bolt as shown. Next, unlock the generator door and open sharply. Secure the generator door along the side of the truck. Remove the grounding strap and the grounding rod from its housing inside the generator compartment. Use the hammer located behind the driver's seat to hammer the grounding rod into the ground fully. Check the attachment of the cable to the grounding rod to make sure that it's secure. Use the auxiliary grounding strap and place it on the ground. Next, open the latch and pull out the generator. Once the generator is pulled out fully, engage the latch, making sure that it engages completely. In this example, you can see that the latch is stuck and is not engaged completely. Correct positioning of the retaining latch is shown here. Next, check the fuel level in the generator. Return the cap to its place and then turn on the fuel switch, which is underneath the left side of the generator. Also check the grounding strap to make sure it's intact. Pass the electrical cable down the ramp and along the side of the truck, ensuring that the ground that the cable does not touch the ground. You can use pieces along the truck and also the door next to the generator cabin in order to secure the cable and keep it off the ground. Correct positioning of the generator cable is shown here. Next, you can start the generator and insert the electrical connection. Make sure the electrical connection is flush. Next, turn on the breaker inside of the truck. You should see the light inside of the truck light. Move the heater button into the operating position. And also move the step for the radiographer into the operating position. And now you're ready to start taking x-rays. Thank you.